Hey, boys and girls, this is Larry, UBRailroad.com. Check me out. Today is January 22nd. Have you ever thought about lining the inside of your tunnels? Well, I'm going to show you what we started when I uh, started with the tin foil. I had a couple people question me, can you paint these before you crumple them? Well, here's what I did. I took a two foot, well, a little over two feet, and I painted this. And uh, as soon as it dries, I'm going to crumple it up and we're going to see how it does. And then if it works good, we're going to insert it into the tunnel and uh, see how that looks when we're all done there. So anyway, sit tight and I'll be right back. Okay, back. Here's a uh, piece that I painted with a couple different browns, crumpled it up and just laid it out. Now you can paint this with any color you want and like I said you could crumple it as hard or as easy as you want but you can see how that's really starting to look rocky especially when you look in a tunnel where it's not really going to be lit up very well but enough to know that it looks very rocky in there. So give this a try you know try and build your own technique you know uh, light crumple heavy crumple you know uh, run your hands over it after you crumple it to smooth them down I mean there this is endless, but it's a very cheap, inexpensive way here. Okay, so let me put this down. I'll install it on the tunnel. This is the last piece. And then I'll show you what both tunnels that I did look like. And you get an idea from there. Okay, I'm back. I got the last piece in. But I couldn't glue it because I ran out of black silicone. So it's a trip to Menards. Oh, boy. Okay. You can kind of see how that's going to look now. That looks really nice and rocky, you know. And then you can always, you know, stick a stick in there or something and flatten things out or puff things out. Do whatever you want to do. And then this outside here, now that's all going to be redone. This isn't finished yet. The mountain's going to come down and there'll be some other things on there. And uh, that's my top tin foil uh, lined tunnel. That's one way of doing it. Another way I do it, I don't know if I show this to you, but I'll show it to you now. I went in here and I used the uh, half inch cedar squares and some cedar slats and made walls and everything for it. So you kind of see the difference of the two. They both both look pretty good, I think. Uh, I think they'd do real well on anybody's railroad. And uh, I think you could uh, kind of see the concept of all of this. It's easy give it a whirl see how it works out for you and if you like leave a like uh, leave a comment subscribe i love hearing from uh, my uh, subscribers so if this works for you great hope it does anyway this is larry over and out